Hi, I'm Ty, and welcome to Mavic Tutorial Video Series. In this video, we'll be showing you how to set up your new Mavic drone with a pre-flight checklist of all the things you need to get you in the air. Just pause the video and take notes if you have to. It's easy, so let's get started. Now, it may seem obvious, but do inspect the aircraft for any physical damage from the previous flight or during transportation. Once you've done that and everything is fine, Check these items to make sure you have everything. The Mavic drone, the remote controller, an intelligent flight battery, additional propellers, a micro SD card if you plan on using the camera to take photos or videos, and a mobile cell phone to connect to the remote and run the DJI GO app on. Next, let's check your batteries to make sure they're fully charged and working properly. You check the intelligent flight battery by pressing the power button once. Check the battery in your remote by pressing its power button once. Now check your mobile device and make sure you have enough battery for a full flight. Also, make sure to download the DJI GO app from the App Store or Play Store in advance where Wi-Fi is available. And make sure it runs correctly on your device. Before we do our electronics test, let's get the aircraft physically ready for flight. Unfold the arms of the Mavic and extend the propellers as straight as you can. And don't worry, they will fully extend when they start spinning around properly. Remove the plastic gimbal cover and then remove the gimbal clamp. Let's go on and check the electronics of your platform. First, mount your mobile device to the remote controller by slotting it into the arms of the Mavic controller. Attach it to the phone mount, fitting the arms around your mobile device until it fits snugly, like this. Now, unfold both antennas so they are vertically extended. Turn on the remote by pushing the power button once, again, and hold. Once, again, and hold. Now it's on. Before turning on the aircraft, make sure sport mode is off. You want to leave that until you're more confident in flying. So now let's turn the aircraft on. Push the power button once, again and hold. When the aircraft turns on, the rear LEDs will begin cycling through flashes of red, green, and yellow. This indicates that the aircraft is doing a self-check. The gimbal and camera will also perform a self-check turning in each direction before stabilizing. The aircraft will then go into warm-up mode and the lights will start flashing yellow. So now let's launch the DJI GO app to make sure you're getting an image from the camera. Okay, let's test and learn how to start and stop the motors. The remote controller uses a CSC, or Combination Stick Command, to start and stop the motors. To start the motors, pull both sticks down and in. Like that. Once the motors have spun up, they will idle. Watch and listen carefully to make sure the motors are spinning smoothly and that there are no irregular sounds. All good? Congratulations. The Mavic motor test is now complete. You can stop the motors by pulling the throttle or the left stick down for three seconds, like this. To turn everything off, start with the Mavic. Press the power button once, again, and hold. Now the remote controller. Press the power button once, again and hold. And it's off. Now we've gone through our pre-flight checklist. In our next video, we'll be learning how to fly. Thanks for watching.